Hey everyone, in this video, let's take a look at Pixverse and Runway and compare the two to see which one comes out on top. In order to do so, here we are starting with Pixverse. And what I can tell you from working with Pixverse and working with Runway is that they both are at the top of the pile right now when it comes to video and image generators that are out there and available. There are reasons why you might want to use one or the other. And uh, one of the things that is important to note about Pixverse is that Pixverse does offer 60 daily credits that you can use on their platform. And to my knowledge, Runway does not offer that. When you first start off with Runway, you do get some credits that you can take uh, that you can use. But once those credits run out, then you are unable to use the majority, if not all of the functions on Runway. I can tell you with Runway that it is definitely a powerful program and it, it is a uh, uh, early on, definitely was setting the industry standard when it comes to AI video generation and image generation. However, since then, other platforms like Pixverse have really showed up on the scene and made competition for platforms like Runway. Let's compare the two to see what it is that we might be getting ourselves into with either of them. So here with Runway, uh, Siri, with uh, Pixverse, you can see that we have our uh, image and text box. So if we want to do text to video, then we can just type that in. If we have an image that we want to create a video out of, then we can just upload that here with this button. And uh, we have a few other options here that we can take a look at. So we've got um, these ne neat kind of effects. If you're just looking for something kind of cool to put on your social media, then we do have some neat uh, effects that we can play around with. Uh, Fight Club, Kiss Kiss, uh, The Warmth of Jesus, Hug Your Love, Chinese New Year Dressed. Uh, there's some kind of fun little things here. Let's go ahead and click on View More and we can see for ourselves what other options that they have. So you can see here that you can use the Hulk effect, which is kind of fun. And uh, you can put two pictures together so that you can make people hugging. You can do Muscle Surge so you can have uh, even a little baby show up with uh, big muscles and stuff. So that's kind of funny. Uh, we've got the uh, squish it effect. We've got the venom effect. So there's some fun stuff here. I think maybe Pixverse is more geared towards fun, uh, kind of fun content rather than uh, with Runway. It's uh, a little bit more of a, um, a video editing tool. And in fact, Runway does offer uh, video editing. So it really, uh, Runway does have some very robust features. Um, the other thing that they have in, con uh, in common is they also both have lip sync. So if you're looking for a platform to do lip sync, then you can do that with both Runway and Pixverse. Uh, I would say that with both, you're getting some good results from the video and from the images. Um, but Pixverse is probably a little bit more geared towards fun and it does offer those free daily credits. So that's kind of a big deal if you're just looking for something that you wanna uh, play around with. Um, now, one thing I can tell you with the credits is that they go fast. You really can only do a couple of generations per day because I believe, uh, for example, if we just go here to image and text and let's say, well, you can already see it here for yourself. So it costs 30 credits just to do an image generation. So realistically, you can do like two images or two videos, or you can do an image and then do a video generation of that. But aside from that, there's not too much more that you're gonna be able to do on the free plan, but it is quite nice to just at least be able to test out the functions. That to me is a big deal when it comes to different AI platforms. If you can't test their functions, then it's really hard to know how to spend your money and a lot of these platforms you know it uh, they definitely are asking for money with the subscriptions and different things like that so you want to be informed and know that you're paying um, for something that you uh, want to use and so it's nice that Pixverse offers though you uh, offers credits even though it is somewhat limited so let's just go ahead and take a look at runway and 
With Runway, I would say that of the two, Runway is just much more robust in terms of all the different tools that it offers. So here on the left-hand side, you could see that we have video generation, image generation, and even audio generation. This is somewhat of a newer feature, but you can actually generate audio with Runway now. So just between those three things right there, that gives you a lot of tools that you would need if you're interested in, in video AI generation. Let's go ahead and take a look at the tools here. And you can see that uh, with Runway, we have access to a lot of different tools. We've got our video, our audio, our lip sync, We've got the ability to remove the background, uh, text to image, image to image, and there are some other uh, useful tools here depending on what you might need. Some of them are just kind of in order to do some fun stuff, some cool stuff. Uh, you know, you got 3D textures here. Uh, in painting is something that um, is important and it's kind of standard with some of the more robust generators that are out there. Having in painting is sort of a must. And uh, you can see some other things here. We've got super slow motion. We can add depth of field. We can remove silences. We can add subtitles. We can upscale. We can do motion tracking. So that's a, a big feature as well. That I'm, is one of those things where I would put this higher up because I do think that having motion tracking is kind of important. Um, essentially what motion tracking is, is if you want to isolate a specific thing in your image that you want to have motion, then you can use the motion tracking to do that. So that's really quite useful if you plan to use AI for video generation. Um, one of the things here, let's go ahead and just take a look at the difference in pricing. So we'll see here with Runway that we have our yearly and we have the standard at 144 a year. And we have the monthly standard at $15 a month. So let's go ahead and take a look at Pixverse and compare the two. So you could see here that the standard is $8 a month. So that already is uh, you know, a, a significant reason for why you might wanna do one over the other. Uh, quite honestly, I would say that um, when it comes to video generations, Im image generations, and having a, a full suite of, 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 uh, of services with the platform, um, I think that Pixverse is, in many ways, is going to be a better, uh, uh, a better value for your dollar. Uh, the main reason that I would choose Runway compared to many other different uh, platforms that are out there is the runway, let me see if I can find it here. I didn't see it before actually, now that I think about it. It's the uh, runway, oh, let me see here now, I gotta find out. Yes, the runway act one. So that is the main feature here that uh, I would personally be interested in when it comes to runway. And I believe that we're gonna find that in the Video generator, yes we do. So you can see here that we have Act 1. And um, what Act 1 allows you to do, this is one of the more powerful tools that are out there, is you can actually put your own video in of a performance, uh, and then you can use AI to overlay on top of that performance. So when it comes to tools like Lip Sync, for example, you know you could do Lip Sync and you can generate with Lip Sync, um, but with the ability to actually take your performance and then overlay AI on top of that, that's kind of a big deal when it comes to AI filmmaking. Um, that is really the main reason why I would be personally interested in using Runway rather than some of the other platforms that are out there. That Act 1 feature is a reason to take advantage of a Runway subscription. Let's take a quick look here. I see that we have some credits and uh, I believe these credits are left over from before. So this is uh, pri previously I was using Runway and so I have some leftover credits from that. Um, but uh, let's go ahead and let's just see the details here really quick. No, nope, that's not what we're looking for. So yeah, as far as I know, I don't see anything um, that says that we get any Yes, okay, here we go, right? So the free version includes 125 credits one time. 
So you get those 125 credits. So th those credits I have there, those are left over from uh, previously. And uh, But here with the free version, you do get 125 credits to play around with Runway. But that's kind of where Pixverse has the advantage because they're giving you those 60 credits every single day. Even though that only amounts to a couple of generations, that's still more than what Runway is going to offer. But that being said, Runway is more robust in terms of the features it offers and that act one uh, feature is a major reason why i would use runway over another platform or at least i would want to take advantage of that for getting performances so that gives you an idea of what to expect with pixverse and runway um, what you do that I, I would say that they're they're both competitive in many ways um, it depends on what you're looking for if you're looking for something that uh, is um, a little bit more generous with the credits and a little bit more geared towards fun, then you might want to go with Pixverse. If taking advantage of something like Act 1 is something that you're interested in, then I would definitely say that you should take a look at Runway. Just be aware with Runway, you are looking at uh, a little bit uh, a little bit pricier for those subscriptions. So that's all there is to it. If you found this video helpful, please leave a comment and like and subscribe for more helpful tips.